the definition for laundry area was added for the 2020 NEC, and it, it's very much like kitchen and bathroom. Once you have requirements, then you need definitions. And we've had requirements for laundry areas for quite some time in the NEC. Uh, we need to have the circuits required for them in dwelling units in uh, 210.11 and the receptacles in 210.52, I think it's F if I'm not mistaken. Uh, GFCI protection is in 210.8A for dwelling units, and then new to the 2020 code, 210.8B for other than dwelling units. And by the 2020 code, we have enough requirements throughout the code that it was time for a definition. So a laundry area is an area containing or designed to contain a laundry tray, a clothes washer, or a clothes dryer. All right, I think most of us know what a clothes washer and a clothes dryer is. Here in the photograph, we've got examples of each. We have some washers and we have some dryers. Uh, what is a laundry tray? Well, a laundry tray is actually um, one of those deep sinks that you might find in a laundry room. For whatever reason, and I have no idea why this is, uh, those are called laundry trays. So here in the NEC, if you have an area that has a laundry tray, a clothes washer, or a clothes dryer, or is designed to contain contain one of those, got to be careful. If your laundry area doesn't have one of those in it when the house is built, well then, does that mean it's not a laundry area? It's like, okay, you got a receptacle for a dryer, a receptacle for a washer, but they're not there, so it's not a laundry. Well, no, it contains them or it's designed to contain them. Once you put that receptacle in there, it's a laundry area. Be sure to like, follow, subscribe, and ring the bell.